I kind of had, had it in my, the back of my mind that I want to achieve something in professional sports. So I became a professional boxer. But now I'm back to my real uh, last name, Noel Mikhailian. Yes, I have Russian and Hosum, German Right now, for Armenia, it's a very tragic and sad time with all that stuff that's happening there. Other Armenians, and uh, there were idols for me when I was a child, and it was like really uh, motivated for me. I was an international champion with them, international champion with the WBO, junior world champion. Actually, I won the WBC Super Diamond uh, Championship, like it's a, the biggest world title. I don't want to injure myself right now because of my career, but there are so many things like skydiving I want to do. Sail im Ingeroin, Fernandan, Mami Venaki. Da mag ik spannend in hem zo gewoon. Oeh. Oeh. I am uh, born in Yerevan, Armenia, and I'm raised in Germany, and now I live here in Miami, Florida. I started boxing when I was uh, around 12 years old. After school, I was always training, and my stepdad was a successful uh, professional fighter, also from Armenia, and then I was following his footsteps. I never thought that I would be like a professional boxer, because I, I wasn't a good amateur boxer or something, but then, I kind of had it in my, the back of my mind that I want to achieve something in professional sports. So I became a professional boxer. Long story short, uh, my real name is Noray Mikhailian. And uh, as I said, I'm, from, uh, I'm raised in Germany and many Germans have the problem to pronounce my name. So Noray, like they can, they can read the name. Uh, also Mikhailian. So my, uh, I had a, a friend from Portu Portugal and he was always calling me Noel, which is almost the same meaning like Norair, right? Like Norair in Armenia, Noel Christmas, like a new age or something, like a new man. So uh, he was always calling me Noel. And then when I started my professional career, my first manager said, you know, like for the audience, it's better to put your first name Noel because it's easier to pronounce because it's more international. And Gevor was the last name of my stepdad, which was already, uh, who was already very uh, established in professional boxing. For marketing reasons, they put it Noel Gevor. But now I'm back to my real uh, last name, Noel Mikhailian. Well, I'm really proud that I can uh, represent uh, my roots on, an, 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 on a professional boxing stage all around the world. And we are so, uh, such a little population and I'm very proud that I'm able to do that. Armenia spread, Armenians are spread around the world, but as I said, there are so little, like only 10 million people, Armenians all over the world. And I always enjoy when I'm traveling, when, and I travel a lot, if everywhere on earth you meet an Armenian. And there's so many like successful, intelligent Armenian people, it's like really a pleasure to meet like Armenians all over the world. And I like to also yeah, now in Miami or in Los Angeles to connect with uh, people like you guys and uh, other different Armenians all over the globe. Yeah, right now for Armenia it's a very tragic and sad time with all that stuff that's happening there and um, yeah I was uh, going on marshes and volunteering and supporting our people doing donations and helping other organizations to raise funds and I help where I can and promote it also as an on social media as a professional athlete and it's uh, yeah it's really sad times right now. Well, I had it in the back of my mind when I was growing up because my stepfather was a professional fighter and I was always like watching all these professional fighters in Germany where it was like the capital for professional boxing in Hamburg. Like the Klitschkos are from there and like many big names, other Armenians and uh, they were idols for me when I was a child and it was like really uh, motivated for me but I really never thought about it since I finished high school and went to uh, college. 
And actually I was studying law for two, sem two semesters and I was doing sparring partner at that time. And then I thought, uh, like people were saying, you have much talent to become some, somebody in professional boxing. And I said, since I'm young, I want to achieve something in sports. Like I can do business and everything else later in my life. And so I became a professional boxer. <laughs> Like, it doesn't mean like wife boxing champion, it's a WBC belt, World Boxing Council, like it's the biggest and best uh, sanctionary in boxing and I was an international champion with them, international champion with the WBO, junior world champion, actually I won the WBC Super Diamond uh, Championship, like it's a, the biggest world title in the World Boxing Super Series, which was a scandalous decision in 2018 in uh, Chicago, which is, uh, which the press also wrote about it but everybody knows like that I made it in that uh, tournament so yeah I didn't I had a good road well that's difficult to answer because I, I usually live by the motto uh, the best is yet to come but uh, if you ask me that way like the best part of my careers like that I can with my career I can help people uh, around me my loved ones my family and uh, support everybody around me that was like it's the best part of my career uh, so many things like my girlfriend's now pushing for skydiving and like <laughs> fun stuff like that but I want to injure myself right now because of my career but there are so many things like skydiving I want to do But most important, I would say, like in boxing, they say when the fight starts, they say protect yourself at all times inside the ring. But I would say you should take, like young boxers should uh, think about it and like uh, do it also uh, besides, like outside of the ring, because that's more important. I learned with my career that outside of the ring, like who's around you, who's you know, like promoting you, who's your manager, who you're working with, is like very, very important and you should always protect yourself like at all times. Also inside the ring, obviously, but I mean, it's uh, very important. But I would like to add Hargilov and Marv Kansvor, Hi and Chen Askanum, Dramar interviewing Meng Anglin Aritzing. Yes, Nayev Russian and Hosum, Germaneren, Hayeren, U Ispaneren, Sovorumem, Sail im Engeruin, Fernandan, Mami Venaki. It's a small gift from the US Armenians. Oh, thank you very much. Appreciate it. I'm curious what that could be. You love presents, I know. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Do something more? Yeah. Oh, wow. I'm proud. I'm a proud US Armenian. <laughs> thank you guys. Really appreciate that. It's very, very kind.